Slagathor's just on fire now, by the way. Like, until this mutate, until we change the mutation, Slagathor will be, in fact, on fire. <laughs> I forgot about Bumblebee. Yeah, Bumblebee's, uh... Right there. Bumblebee got to live. Bumblebee has scanner eyes, so... I don't want to do too much on Bumblebee. Then again, we keep seeing the bugs, so maybe maybe scan scanner eyes is not too much of a problem right now. Actually, we got like scanner eyes in our yeah, we got three right there. So Bumblebee is holding some some bugs. I guess it doesn't hurt to like stock up on more, considering how important scanner eyes are for anything resembling a uh, just realize you got a pink ass. Really? Like, I knew John had a, had pink toes and the end of his snout is pink, but I didn't realize his ass was pink as well. <laughs> Just a bit, uh... <laughs> there we go. want to do that? Why? Why would I want to do that? Even though I was doing that a second ago. See, I don't trust Slagathor too long, because he's holding items that he can eat automatically. I don't want him to. <laughs> Alright, uh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Alright. Alright, already, already, already. Oh no, there's like eight more. Why don't they just congeal them into like one or two fucking things? Like, we gotta spend like eight minutes whenever there's fucking stones just knocking them off shit. We spend way too much time just knocking these stones off because they're so important. Look at a little bug. Um, Toothpaste also has scanner eyes now I think about it. There we go. John, come here. Come here. Okay, all good? Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Stop focusing on its ass, Bex. Well, I'm sorry. It's like two-thirds of its body now. Oh, guys, this is how the flesh squids eat. <laughs> so these are pieces of coal, right? And the slit in the, the... We call them flesh squids, but that's not their real name. They lay on them, and then they heat them up. We were not supposed to see that pop like that. And that's how they eat, is, is thermal regulation. And apparently they're like really good friends with Trevum. Apparently we used to write like stories about them being like children's characters and shit, like from children's stories. And I'm like, oh my God, that's, that's perfect. You guys want to steal this guy's, uh, egg? egg. Wanna... Wanna, wanna steal this asshole's egg? And then, like, eat it? It's fine, it's not worth it. No, don't eat that! Fuck, I fucked up. That was an accident, I'm sorry. There's no cancel ability- uh, cancel thing, shit. Oh well. Not too big of a deal. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Ghost oven. I know, right? So yeah, um, they're called like I don't know. I didn't memorize the names of anything. Squar is an easy name to remember, and it's something that we just did, so you know that's why I remember that. But outside of that. Okay, what is our map? 
go to the right. We need to go to the right around the mountains. And we gotta keep going right- Ah, oh, so much horizontal! So much horizontal. Hey, the next area might have water, though. That's good. Oh, I can hear the heartbeat. <laughs> Um, is this the pass? Yeah. Okay. So we got this mountain pass, right? We need to go straight, go to the left a bit, around a, around a, th around a gap, and then go horizontal to the thing. But palpitations. Oh god. <laughs> Don't word it like that. It just makes it so much worse. It's just so much worse. Anyway. Oh, I killed the worm. I'm so sorry, worm. Alright, hopefully that's enough. Alright, you guys ready? Ugh, this one's gonna be fun too. The lat- They're getting def- They're definitely- getting more difficult with these. Uh, this one's not too bad depending on where the gap is. There's, there's the gap. It's not too bad, actually. Oh yeah, this is very doable, actually. I was a little afraid, but it's not too bad. I think if we went in without knowing, it'd be worse. All right. I say that before the horizontal. Run! Run, the flesh squids, run! I hope they don't die. Run, my friends. Speaking of run, oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit. No! Don't bounce off! Who died? Who just died? I can hear them. I think they're glitched. How's it going, guys? I don't like its butt. It's so distractingly awful. Beware, oh, no. the voice in their memories cried out. Oh, shit! The mathematician <laughs> has been summoned. This place was no longer safe. Fucker! <laughs> you... No! 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 Oh, shit. It's not good. Not the pimple, the, the mathematician fucking everything up just now. Licky things run! Yep, there it goes. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, no! I don't even know where I'm going though! Oh no, it's so far away. There's the thing. No, 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 no. Shit. <laughs> I don't have enough stamina or stomach or anything. D don't at me, pimple man! I just have what I have. Which is not enough. Fuck. 
Good dog. We got so... It was such a close one last time, and now this one. Everyone teleport, quickly! Fuck. <laughs> what just died next to me? As the Trebum continued their voyage to the desert, they felt a strange sense of being observed. But this was not the cruel gaze of the cylinder and its servants. No, it was almost as if someone was trying to help them, laying out a path for them to find. The voice in their memories encouraged them to go forward. Did y'all hear that scream of whatever died right next to us, by the way? Did y'all hear that scream? Like, I don't even know what animal that would have been. Was that maybe an ostrich? <gasps> you know what I just realized? That pack of flesh squids we saw while running, they're all dead. <laughs> Aw. I don't like to think about all of our friends dying. <laughs> I say friends. They're friends because they didn't try to murder us. Mm, of course, there's ostrich assholes. The flying spaghetti monster's looking out for them. You make that joke, but look. I mean, you're j I know you're making a joke. Crash, but I'm just saying. <laughs> the uh, other Daves, as we've been calling them, uh, they're not exactly non spaghetti. <laughs> like, honestly, with what you've seen of this game, are you really surprised? <gasps> Actually, water. Cool. Do they have one I need? I think maybe they have to be- it has to be Savannah. Uh, what was it? What was the thing we needed? We needed, um... What was it, this thing? Memory cluster suggests these mushrooms. Nope, there's none. Just cross the water. Don't even deal with that shit. I didn't mean to kill the worm. Sorry, I was just trying to eat its literal shit because it's nutritious. So then another... So there's now another story beat here. Actually, wait. Beam me up, Sparky. Do it! Take me! Take me! Do it! Do it! Take me! Do it! Do it, you coward! Come back, you asshole! Do it! Do it! Hurry up already! There we go. You know, that's fine. Come on. Let me go. I think you were supposed to let me go by now. I think you were supposed to let me go by now. No! God damn it. Damn it. Stop it. <laughs> no! So many fucking ostriches! We'll get the, the, those upgrades here in a second. We need to do a thing. Wait. Where's Slagathor? I don't trust you. Grab more of those, because why not? What are they attacking? Yo! Yo, mate, what are you killing? Hey! Nah, don't, don't, don't go killing the, the, the flesh squids. Don't be mean like that. <laughs> I 
tried. Run, flesh squids, run! Alright, so, um, we are looking for eggs. And we are looking for... I, I mean, there's the upgrade station, but I don't know if that's actually the story beat, or... Oh, it's a fluffy pimple. And before you ask, yes, I have already scanned the fluffy pimple. Stop arg I mean, antagonizing everyone, you jerk. Uh, you mean you mean the the guy who the guy with the the, the bulbous gas bubble or? I'm gonna borrow this. I tried. <laughs> Just gives no shits. Oh. That's a story beat. That's what we're looking for. I meant you picking fights with people that are bigger than you. What? Look, if the pterodactyls would give me, like, you know, things. Things that I can use right now to uh, revive people. Let's revive our friends, including Dave. As long as this ostrich doesn't kill him immediately. So our tribe in the cloud. That's right, we put Puff in the cloud. Okay. So let's bring back everyone who died. Alright. Who do we actually need? <laughs> Alright, do we want to put anyone away, I should ask? What do you guys think? Any any requests on people who stay and people who go? I guess we don't need more than one engine. So we can put John up. John has healing as well, but we got Nebula back and Nebula does healing. Nebula's my favorite. <laughs> Mindy Fresh is just plain terrifying. I I vote we put Minty Fresh back in into the storage. What do you guys think? <laughs> um. We got John, we got Dave. Do we put Dave up? Hmm. Do you guys want to keep John or Dave as I hit the microphone? Good by me? Well, yeah, and Minty Fresh is fucking terrifying. It's for sort of the good of the whole tribe that Minty Fresh gets put away. <laughs> Dave, keep me. We got one vote for Dave. I don't know, though. We do have too many of the Daves. We don't keep Dave around. He's gonna freak out. <laughs> All right, we'll put John up instead. <laughs> Rusty also has the engine, so... In fact, who do we have? We got Deep Fried, we got Slurp, we got Rusty, we got Chip, we got Puff, we got Minty Fresh, and we got John. And then... And then, uh, in the- in the- we got Muff, we got unofficially named, um, uh, Chungus. We didn't- we don't get to name our first one, so this is Chungus. Um... Wow, Crash. I mean... <laughs> I don't know. We do have too many Daves, you know? We could... Rusty's been, you know, just, you know, rusting in there this whole time. It doesn't seem... It doesn't seem quite right to... <laughs> Alright, I think this is good. We got Muff, we got Chungus, we got Nebula, we got Toothpaste, Bumblebee, Dave. Oh, uh... I thought we had more. Oh, yeah. And we got Cosmo, who's our, who's our, uh, puzzler. Alright. No one had... No, it's fine. Ah! Oh, no! All the bombs! Oh, no! 
Whoops! I didn't even consider the possibility! Oh my god, we just lost 20 bombs! We just lost two stacks of bombs. That is 100% my fault. I am so sorry. <laughs> it didn't even occur to me that we would have to be careful about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna uh, move these items to uh, no, it's fine. All right, mutation tree. What do we need? We need those mushrooms. And we need sucker mushrooms, so. Suckers and the other mushrooms, so. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, whoever I'm playing as needs to be holding these so they don't accidentally eat to them. Uh, you could have a fish, and you get the other fish. In fact, we'll do it. This way. There we go. Oh, this way. Okay. Real quick, my camera feed's going off. Uh, that's all good. Oh shit! What's killing me while I check my camera feed? My security camera, not not I don't have a base cam. You guys know this. Alright, um So what's this? Uh, we're gonna save anything that might be progress until after we do the upgrades, just in case. <laughs> Alright, so there is... there. There? I still never figured out what these things do. Um, there is the, uh, bring people back to life storage system thingy. So we got our, our Pokemon PC, there's an upgrade thing, and then there's a latch over there. We're gonna do the upgrade thing first, because we know that's not gonna progress the story. And then we're gonna do the other one. Shame, shame, Bex live 2D win. Um, okay, so dust, dust. You know about dinosaurs, right, Dust? You and I, we talk about paleontology all the time. Dust, when you look at a dinosaur face on, and it's a carnivore that isn't T-Rex, what's the number one notable thing about their eyes? <laughs> what is the number one notable thing about the eyes of a non-T-Rex theropod? Think, uh, you, you know the answer to this. Here's a hint, it's also the case with birds. Non-binocular vision. <laughs> it's a bad case of the derps, is, 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 is what's up with that. So, uh, you Tyrannus, I looked it up, you Tyrannus is not much better. The eyes still have a bad case of the derp. So, no. <laughs> Unless I stylize it to where the eyes face forward, that is not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost as if birds are not known for facing directly forward. Get all these down, get them down! Oh, you know what we should have done? We should have spawned in someone with the feet, the jumping feet. Shit, I didn't even think about that. Oh well. Guys, I'm sorry. I started the stream with one of these, and I thought it would be a while before we got more, but uh, nope, we're gonna do a lot more upgrades. Which is fine, I guess, but. <laughs> oh, there that ghost. No, wait. Okay. Uh, How 
he's not being knocked down. Are you shitting me right now? Was that knocked? Not, 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 le, 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 not knocked down. So there's rock. Are there rocks behind these walls? Nope. They've adjusted the caves a little bit between this and last time, and then definitely a little bit between last time and the time before that. There we go. Fuck. Y'all see Slagathor eating something? I need to switch him like ASAP to stop him. I think it's too late by that point, though. Once the animation starts, they're eating. In fact, just in case, I should probably refill our water. Zoom the water. Damn, I gotta get out of bed and go to the bathroom now. You could pee really far. Um, okay, so thankfully that's not pee, but that in mind, thank you the for reminding Crash. The projection shared a recipe with the Trevor. One which could protect them from the light of the cylinder's servants. Woo! What the hell is that metal item, actually? What the hell is that one? Nights a small flame at the end of the Trebum's trunk. But what the fuck is that ribbony thing? Oh, and, uh, Fluffy. <gasps> we can get Fluffy just, like, real quick. Fluffy would be easy. <gasps> Scanner eyes! We need a... Oh, we need a dead Licky dude! We gotta kill a Licky dude, guys! God damn it, I wish we kept one now. Damn, if we had kept one! Oh, we need a dead Licky dude! Oh, shit. How to kill one. How to find one. We everything's Arctic right now. I don't do they have an Arctic variant? Oh. Oh no. But once we get that, that's great, because then we can uh scan just give everyone scanner eyes. And switch between amber when we need it, which would be ideal. Big rock. See, this is what I was talking about. Like, why don't they just give us big rocks? Alright, um... Yeah, see? There's a lot less on the walls this time. I know we already covered this particular wall, but there's, there's less overall is my point. And they just gave us one big rock. That's great. That's perfect. Fire's just so fucking goofy. I kinda... I really want those, but I also don't want to be here for fucking ever. up here. I'm gonna try again to get what we can, but I really don't think we can get all of them. Just kinda... <laughs> Alright, men. How far can you... Can you go this far? <laughs> uh, the... The... The, the uh, uh, relevant people in the audience? <laughs> Not with that attitude. <laughs> I mean... I just did. Oh, gross. 
Yeah, fuck it. Fuck it all. I'm not gonna spend a billion years trying to get every fucking rock I can't actually get. That in mind, I do think we needed them for some mutations. So, wh what did we need? We may not do upgrades this time, just so I know I have enough for mutations. I didn't need any. Um... I need suction cup. Don't even know what this is. <gasps> Wait! Three of them? Get that out of there. <laughs> that was a close one. Like, damn. <laughs> Electro skin. That's from the fish, right? Um, We can get this one super easy. Uh... This one. We need a licky dude, and we need two of the level things. So at least for a little while. We need a licky dude. Ooh. Hmm. Where's my three-eyed guy? Slagathor, come here. Slagathor. It sounds like something from, uh, E-Man. <gasps> Skin tree bark. Ew! <laughs> what? <laughs> This bark comes from the thermophile skin tree, a cave plant that evo has evolved the ability to, to directly absorb heat. As heat courses through the plant, energizing the growth of new tissue, add old layers of bark, gradually pale off. Oh. So if we find a tree in a cave, we need to set it on fire. Huh. Also, ew. It's ew. Hey, Glickball, we need a dead one. <laughs> All right. Um. All right. We could upgrade. We we could, but I think I'm gonna hold off for just a little bit in case there's more later that requires the gems. Like we just upgraded. Like this is very quick for us. I guess because we're trying to unlock the recipes for mutations. So yeah, we need to find a, a flesh tree. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, all right, and then where's that last one over here? Flesh tree. Hmm. I mean... I don't know, I'm just- just checking. Heat up the flesh tree and take its skin. Yeah, not- it's not just flesh tree and then heat it up. You have to make it have a sunburn and then let it peel and then... Eat that. You're eating the peeled skin of a burnt tree- of a burnt flesh tree. There's so much to take in with that, but I don't- I don't know if I want to. <laughs> There's a Trebum house. Remember, we're doing no Trebum houses, eggs only. <gasps> and a hole in the ground! Yeah! Hole in the ground. You guys see any trees? <laughs> Sounds chewy. Ugh. So much to take in with the flesh tree. I just, there's a lot to process with it, I will admit. There's there's a lot. There's just a random incubator, too. Why, what is with the random incubators? It makes me feel like we're missing something. <gasps> Wait. There's an egg, like, right there. Oh, I get it. We have to get the egg across to the thing. I get it. Okay. There we go. Hi! What do we want to name this one? Is it immediate? What is with them immediately hiding themselves from the camera? Star 
three. Dave three. We got too many Daves. Dave, Dave. We got too many Daves. No Bex. We're not naming them Bex. None of them will be named Bex. Because it's a cutie. No! Look, look. First of all, Bex sounds like an actual Trubum name. Straight up, if you if we popped open an egg and the Trubum who came out was named Bex, would you really be surprised? Like legit. Would you really be surprised if one of these guys was defaulted to be named Bex? Call it crash. <laughs> I don't know, Stanley's the one giving me grief right now. <laughs> Crash, do you want do you want to you want to Trubum named after you? No, no, and no. Crash, come on, you know better. No, guys, come on, you guys know better. No. Guys, you're my mods. It's like Heracles, but not. No! Call it waifu? No, what? Do you. Do you want a Trubum to be your waifu? S Stanley. Stanley. Do you. Do, do you need. Do you need some. some help? Do, do you need some help, Stanley? I'm not naming it that either, Crash! No. I'm- I want its name to be Waifu. Triple- oh god. I don't- they don't got that dust. <laughs> I don't- I don't even know if they have- I guess they must have something since they have, uh, sexes and babies, I guess, so- But the- the- I don't want to know what they got, to be honest. Something tells me it's not exactly mammalian. <laughs> I tried to play by your rules. Roberto. <laughs> We're just going with Roberto. This is this was your long play all along, wasn't it? Just, just just name a bunch of names I would say no to and then name something something normal. Roberto? No, it's Roberto. Alright, Roberto. Um grab those flesh cubes. <laughs> All right, um, I'm a little worried as to why they wanted us to have one of these, uh, just a guy. Wow, Slagathor. Wow, asshole. Dude was just born and you're like, go take a dip in that freezing cold water. Like, like what the hell, man? Um, maybe I got that rock. <gasps> A rock! Alright. Oh, shit, an engine. <laughs> Where's Chungus? Where's anyone? Is everyone stuck up top? That usually is what happens when I go down. Here. Um, everyone's still alive. But not for long. Alright, um. Then magically transfer items across wherever the fuck. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to the world, kid! <laughs> Rubber toe. Y'all are scaring me. Y'all are my mods. I don't know what you guys are planning. If you're anything like me, then you're gonna- then you guys abuse your mod status like crazy. <laughs> Rubber toe? I barely knew her. God damn it. <gasps> wait! Wait, wait, wait! Jumpy ability! Oh my god, yes! Jumpy ability. I wanna save this. I wanna somehow save this. Oh, we need a square. Yeah! Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Get your asses down here. Not all of you, just some of you. What? 
what I do? A saint. He's so shaped. Yes, he is. <laughs> shaped like your mom. Oh, fuck, I did. And now everyone's down here being dumb and swimming in the cold ass water. Because I did a dumb and knocked down all the shit. Yeah, I know you're freezing. go. Oh my god. Free stuff. I forgot that Chunkus had like the demon eyes. Alright, who gets what? Um. Oh, I guess the guy who normally carries the blue stuff died. He was one of the ones who died apparently. That or we used up the blue thing. Worth a try. <laughs> We're all freezing to death. No one saved it naturally. I wish we could aim the fucking trunks. This is fine. <laughs> and then everyone was died. The end. <laughs> Y'all didn't see any trees down there, did you? <laughs> yeah, don't worry. They all teleport. See? Look at this guy. He is... Uh, Oh wait, while I'm here, while I'm here, we need to find the the mushroomy things. Uh Eat that bug. But we need to find um We got the puff balls. Now we need mushroom. What is that ostrich doing? I don't even know. What's happening over there? So we got the puff balls, and we need um, the mushrooms, which should be around here, somewhere, anywhere, maybe. So Ash is trying to kill us, but is like trapped. What's happening there? I'm gonna say probably. This guy's name is Vup. Go eat shit, Vup. All right, um. Look, I'm gonna be honest with you. I would totally leave my house if it meant surviving the death cylinder. I'm just saying, I, I probably, I wouldn't request food or whatever the fuck that they usually request. I would just be like, oh, you guys are not going to let the cylinder of death kill you? I'm in. <laughs> you know, I, I don't, I don't understand the troubles in their trouble home going, you know, oh, I I'll only join you in the not death if you give me these items three. And it's like, no, I'd rather you th 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 take people who want to live. I know that's an odd concept, but you know, it's people who want to live typically make better family members. No, Slagathor, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. No, didn't I tell you fuckers? Didn't I tell you? The moment I looked away, the moment I looked away, he started eating the items we need to be saving. Fucking. Boo. Didn't I tell you? Called it. By the way, um, 
Do we want to give someone, uh... The funky trunk? You know what? You know what? Hold on to that toothpaste. Don't eat it. Just hold on to it. Are you serious? Can I go three seconds without predators trying to eat me? Seriously, I don't even see it. Is it that ostrich from before? Or... Is it a pterodactyl? Oh, it's a pterodactyl. Oh, it's fine. Okay, so, if you guys didn't see it in the other streams, the pterodactyl things will pick us up and usually not harm us. They Okay, so they, they can harm us, but for some reason they don't usually and they they take us up to their nest which are those weird pathologic towers and from there if you go if you actually end up on top of the tower and not like next to it which tends to happen more often then there's a bunch of shit up there that can be converted into points like here do it do it you bastard do it I dare you. Did you? What's happening? Oh. Alright. Well, hypothetically, it would take us to the tower. It seems to be a wee bit stuck, to be honest. Just kind of. Uh. Okay. Uh, well. <laughs> Hypothetically Oh, those are our friends I'm like, what the fuck just fell from the sky? <laughs> what is it doing? What are you doing? The, are you Are you trying to kill us? What? Fuck off. Yeah, see? How do you like that? Fuck off. I didn't know that would kill it, actually. That's news to me. Give it a golden shower. I, I, it normally just flies away. I didn't think it would die. <laughs> I, I seriously did not realize that killed it. Keep forgetting to say yeah, we gotta save these. Would these go here? Yeah. Just remember to save those. Alright, so now we need uh the mushroom. So mushroom Ugh. Not that mushroom, the other mushroom. This one. Which hypothetically should be like right next to us. Just kinda walk around here, don't mind me. Just kinda make our way over here. Ah, closer. You feel it in my guts. Uh, oh. There we go. How many do we need? All right, cool. Now, station tree, uh, fluffy. Yay! Now we can become fluffy whenever the fuck we please. Woo! Must have been a weeb. Oh no. We're supposed to believe these creatures are helpless, but they're apex predators. Okay, no, 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 okay. So we as a species are not helpless, but we are literally newborns. That in mind, we are the most intelligent species, question mark? We're part of a dead civilization. Or partially dead, whatever. We're from a civilization. This is all from like, Trevum technology and shit. 
like you saw the recordings and stuff. The recordings aren't magic; they're technology. We do have a strong sense of of uh, shared memories, though. That what's that's what makes Trebum special, is that they share memories and shit. Okay, so there's flesh tree weirdness. We already got that. We need more of the orange mushrooms, and then we need a dead licky boy. Where the fuck are we gonna get a dead licky boy that's uh, in the middle of the Arctic? They did that on purpose. There's no way in hell you would have a licky boy this late. A dead one, anyway. Yeah, see? Uh. And then, uh, where's the other mushroom? The other mushroom. This thing. Joyous. Okay. I did civilization with an active narrator. Uh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what the narrator I would have to do with anything. I don't think the narrator is in our heads directly, because the narrator definitely knows more than the trouble. Uh, I think the narrator is literally a narrator. Oh my god. Oh, there's a lot of this in this area. Look at that. Alright, and we're saving that in case we need that for a mutation later, honestly. No, no major reason to keep these. These things, when eaten, let us uh, have stronger water sprays, which is a little helpful, but honestly not necessary. Like, it's much better to have the jumping ability, which we're saving. Sorry I'm transferring items like this, by the way. There, there's, a, there's a lot to manage at this point. <laughs> Consume, consume rock. They're giving us a lot of upgrades too, I've noticed, which is a little alarming considering we haven't reached the desert yet. They're like, here's a bunch of shit for you. And it's like, uh, are you, is this a lead up to something? Maybe, you don't know and neither do we. <laughs> like you wish we would tell you if you're about to get your ass beat. rock. Oh, and hello there. Goodbye. Alright, so, where is that uh, thing? Not that one, the other one. That one. Okay, so we're gonna go here. We're gonna activate whatever story they want to show us, and then we're gonna head off and activate the cylinder. Oh, I thought that was something. And hopefully nothing murders us. I think that sounds like a plan. Uh, hello? Real quick, I'm gonna... <laughs> hold, hold, hold up the whole dramatic-y thing. Just one second. What, what's happening here? I'm glitching out is what it's happening. Hello? Was this a ruin? Some part of an old temple? No. Not quite. Oh, shit. Hey! Another other Dave number eight or whatever number we're on. I think it's seriously like three or four. Don't murder us this time, please. Hi! And it murdered us! Yay! <laughs> well, good game, guys. Oh no! 
Had the Trebum walked into a trap? Was their journey over? Hey, I'm gonna do something really quick, but I'm gonna leave you with the fact that we just been Vored. I'm gonna leave you with that bit of information. I'll be right back. Sorry about that. I'm still just dying. Ow. Ow. I'm still just dying of allergies lately and... Oh god, we really have been bored. Well, this is somebody's fetish. Oh no. Oh no. I don't like this. Just... We are inside... Another other Dave. Or I guess it's yet another other Dave. We had to put another thing on there. What so... was this place? Were the Trebum dead? If so, this was a very odd afterlife. I, I'm just wondering where yet another other Dave's organs are. What? What? There's an adult Trebum in here? And she's made of crystal. What? What is going on? Piss and day. <laughs> God damn. Fine. There. Oh, uh, real quick, because we got a fire anyway. Don't mind that day. <laughs> what have I come into? We got Vord, okay? We got Vord, and stories happening. Shush. Perhaps this strange elder could tell them what was going on. But before they could ask, the elder spoke. The Celestial Trophala have seen your journey, and I have been told of your deeds. There's an old bond between our people, Trebum and Trefala. We once lived in harmony, but the invasion of our world has split us apart. If you do not know their song, the Trefala will not recognize you as a friend, so I am here to help you as much as I can. The floating palaces you seek lie ahead, as you were told but they will be of no use to you unless you reclaim all the powers of our people, which the Cylinder has stolen. There is only one way to do so, by entering the portal that links our world to the dreams of the Eternal Cylinder. The greatest of the Cylinder's servants, the Mathematician, is the Gatekeeper. He absorbs that which is of value to the Cylinder and his master has become intrigued by the crystals that the Trophala wear as crowns. Find these crystals and acquire the mutation which will allow you to appear as one of them. Thus, you will trick the mathematician into granting you passage. And now I must return you to the land. There is little time. The Trophala are being hunted and only few are left. May you succeed in your quest for all our sakes. Ah, oh, gross! Gross! Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, he's throwing us back up again! Okay. Are you getting reverse Vord? Yes, we are. We are getting reverse Vord. Okay. So that's interesting. We did actually enter the portal that they were talking about, the one that's inside the mathematician's head. That's where we found the human ghost. That's why this might be Earth. 
But they said invaders, right? So it's possible that the cylinder invaded Earth or is from Earth, considering all the human uh, human forms we keep seeing. But this is just their next victim. So Earth is dead either way. <laughs> either way, Earth is fucked. <laughs> it's not good for us in either direction. Um, <laughs> both of those hypotheses are not kind to us. Um, um, but that's why the mathematician is killing the snakes, the other Daves. The first Dave we saw... He was dying because the mathematician had hunted him. And we saw the mathematic we saw another dead Dave later on that had a bunch of spears in him. So with that in mind, that's why all the Daves are being hunted by the mathematician. Sorry too many Daves, you're about to be <laughs> Anyway, um that's also why we kept being told that the Daves are co are friendly to us when they haven't been because we don't know how to speak their language. Um because we're newborns, we don't, we just don't know. So with that in mind, we need to find a way to get a mutation from eating the crystals on their heads. We'll become crystal-like. I assume like that one elder, that elder had a crystal skin going on. We need to look like crystals so the mathematician puts us back through that portal again. I guess this time we know what we're doing though? I don't know why we would want to go back if we don't know what we're doing yet. 